Deja vu. Ara bere 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 bere. Deja vu. Sounds like things went well enough in Muspelheim. I mean, probably. Sure didn't want Smar involved. So instead of them combining to form the Ragnarokki, he did a work around that left around him. Well, hopefully he still shows up at Ragnarok, plunges his sword into the heart of Asgard. And where is that exactly? Only Sutter knows. Now I'm dizzy. Deja vu! Whoa. Can I sleep here tonight? Uh, yes you may, but I was... Expecting somebody else. <laughs> Hello guys, it's here. Welcome back to my humble channel. And today we are playing God of. Say it with me. What? <sighs> Time has come. The expiration date for Odin is getting closer. That one eye, old fart, gonna die today. My son, say it with me. Today. Today. More manly today! Today! My son is a manly man! Is that you, Odin? <laughs> Just normal crow, Dad. Is that you, Odin? Again, Dad, that's a crow. How do you tell that apart? Can we go now, Dad? It's time for main mission! I like you, son. There we go, let's go! This is it then, the beginning of the end. The end for Odin, and after that, a new beginning for the rest of us. Atreus. I know. I'm just looking forward to seeing all the realms finally standing up to him. Elves and dwarves and hell itself. You are so certain they will unite? They have to. After everything they've been through, they have to. Don't they? Wait. What the freak the door is that way? Okay. First of all, kids remember this. There's not a lot of people you can trust. And you can count on. Even your family. Don't be sad or disappointed if if not all of them come to help. Sometimes you need to do it alone. Sometimes. I love you, Dad. Uh, I love you too, son. Let's go. Okay. Anything in Midgard you want to do? You know, while we still can? Freya and the others are still making preparations for the attack. So there's time. Like I said, it's time for main mission. Specky Savannah, my favorite wolf. And family too. Deja vu! Ara bere 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 da bere bere! Deja vu! Sounds like things went well enough in Muspelheim. I mean, probably. Sure didn't want Smar involved. So instead of them combining to form the Ragnarok team, he did a work around that left around him. Well, hopefully he still shows up at Ragnarok, plunges his sword into the heart of Asgard. And where is that exactly? Only Sutter knows. Now I'm dizzy. Deja vu! Okay. Ready when you are. Let's go! Two thousand years later.
Would I die if I stand down there? <laughs> you know, curious. All the armies are probably gathered in their home realms, waiting for when we blow Gallarhorn. Guess I was kind of hoping to see some of them here. When all the realm towers open at once, we'll see plenty, lad. Odin will believe what's coming for him. No. Odin had lifetimes to prepare for this. Whatever grows deception, he heard the truth as tear. Do not underestimate him. Yeah. Rousing speech, brother. Very inspirational. Oh. Is that good kind of Valkyrie? Wow. The Valkyries look different. Welcome back. Hilda Spini informed me of your success. We've been planning accordingly. What up, guys? Oh. What would Ragnarok be without Ragnarok? Who else agreed to join us? I see the Valkyries. Better than that. Thank you, girls. Reborn. Corporeal and uncorrupted. Thanks to no small amount of Vanir magic. They're shield maidens now. Nice. And your brother? He came through. The elves called a truce to unite against Asgard. Wow. That gives us an advantage by air. And with Hell's army for a vanguard. Hi. What about Sindri? Will the dwarves fight? We haven't heard from him. But there's time yet. And I think we have what we need to clear a path for the Ragnarok beast. Thank you for all your well, support, you sisters. The power of the sisters. At all. Is that the, the queen? No, you're the queen. Is that the joke? Secret. It's good to see you so alive. Oh, yes. I wasn't myself when last we met. I'm glad you're safe. My queen, the shield maidens will be divided among the forces breaching from Alfheim, Helheim, and here in Midgard. We stand ready. Kratos, Atreus, Hamir, please excuse me. Oh. Good night, then. Freya, have you determined our path out of Asgard? If the towers are the way in, we count on them being the way out. And if they are not? Then we all know what we signed up for. Our plan is only missing one thing. A leader. That honor is yours. You have a righteous claim. And the respect of your troops. And you have faced this enemy before. I held his invading army to a stalemate. This is our invasion. A siege on his terrain. I want our most experienced... What up, ball? Shut up, let me finish. ...general in the field. I don't care about what the up, I don't care about the prophecies and champions. I just need us to win. Freya. I know what I'm asking. Just sleep on it. Sleep with me? Okay, that's weird. Here we are. Kratos, your tent is to the right, and Atreus, yours is to the left. Why did Mine? a young warrior needs his own space, don't you think? Okay. I do. Wow. Thanks. Sleep on what we spoke of. Let me know in the morning what you decide. And boy, don't do anything nasty inside there, okay? We need a good lake when we're in the war. Okay, boy? Oh, hey. Hildy. Is it okay if I just hang out Jonah. here for now? <laughs> nothing's wrong. I just want to be alone. Good thing. Okay. No problem. When she had them distracted, I jumped in, heroic, and together we took them all down. There must have been a hundred. I don't know, maybe more. Spare us your gloating. Does it really bother you that some of my ideas actually work? No, but I do envy you. <laughs> in what realm? Spare me the patronizing. I've calculated every risk I've ever taken. Try to mitigate all the ways it could go wrong, and still, it all falls apart. You, you just throw yourself into situations in harm's way, and somehow it always works out for you. You always end up all right with that stupid grin. I'd argue my trip to Asgard didn't go quite so well. Yes, there are some lessons to be learned by planning, and others by learning to adapt. That's why you choose such a great team. I think it's because we had such a lousy old man. Son, it's true Njord was not much of a father. But he's the reason we were able to be a family. 
Yeah, funny you should be so hard on him, Freyr, since you inherited his wanderlust. Especially in times of importance. That's not true. I had good reason for leaving those times. Tell her. I don't know. <sighs> I have missed this. Yeah. Bonfire without a sun. With wild boar and two twin. And Sigrun, I presume. What up, Night Elf and Light Elf? How you guys doing? Are you nervous, love? I'm nervous. What if they don't accept us? What if they don't follow us into battle? Don't worry. I mean, in their eyes, we're. Are you talking about your love? I thought. And how is that our problem and not theirs? The Uniter has spoken. That should be enough. They will follow. And if it's not enough? Then I will make them. <laughs> that sounds like the elf I fell in love with. Aww. You're shivering. I'm cold. We can leave for Alfheim now if you want. No. No, I'd like to stay here for as long as we can. Freya, hug me! <laughs> I need someone to hug too! My apologies, but I would like to be alone with my thoughts. We will leave you to them then. Okay, go on. What up guys? How you guys doing? I like your wings. It's beautiful. Look like a look like a tiger belt. It's amazing, huh? We're in the cold. You know, united. You know, about to go to the wall and my beard is just flowing. What the freak? Move along. Okay. I don't wanna be alone. Okay, I wanna be alone. Yeah, I can be alone. No problem. Excuse me. Oh, I thought you want to be alone. May I have a moment with Mania? Yes. I don't know what tomorrow brings, but if tonight is our last night, I'd like to spend it feeling something besides hate. Will you tell me one last silly story? There's nothing I'd like more. Except perhaps a dance. Do I may have lost a step? <laughs> Go on, have fun. Do you respect love? I don't tell silly stories. You only tell silly stories. <laughs> I can never argue with you. Everyone got a partner. Just great. Let me dream about my wife, at least. Gallahorn. I can fit in this small tank, that's good. Whoa! Can I sleep here tonight? Uh, yes you may, but I was expecting somebody else. <laughs> You want a pillow, boy? Are you okay? You must quiet your mind. I can't. When I will tell you a story. Aww, bedtime story? From Kratos? If I fall asleep, 
Somebody please do that. Who, what's the name of the the, the, the actor who, who 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 voice for Kratos? Just read a, a really good war story for bedtime. Please. Please do it, man. I, I would listen it every night because I can't calm my mind. I didn't go to war, but every day is like a war to me. Please. <laughs> Promise you'll finish it tomorrow. Of course. Now, close your eyes. There was an old man who chopped wood for his village. Every evening he bore the logs on his back and delivered them to his people. But the logs were heavy, and he grew weaker as time went. And one day, he threw down the logs as he could no longer bear their weight. And he called for death to come to him. Are you talking about yourself? You're the old man? I'm gonna be with my wife. Faye's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of you. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from the taste in men, of course. Brock? She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Leading us home. Hey, Faye. Did request upset you? a natural part of life, my love. You wish only to be prepared for when my time comes. Mortals must do such things. I am glad to have you prepare with me. You're quiet. I have nothing to say. Well? Say something. I enjoy hearing your voice. A funeral pyre. I would have chosen different. Oh? Hmm. 
Okay, so we are doing hand painting on the tree. Okay, you can do that. Anything you want. In my land, we entomb our loved ones. You would have me trapped in the ground for eternity. I would have you close to me. How touching. My rotting corpse would bring you such comfort. Always. You once tried to take charge of your ending, did you not? That was different. Circumstance, yes. But not in purpose. Is that how we meet? I'm trying to kill I try to kill myself and then I found you. Mm. I can do this all day, rubbing your hand on my hand. You prepare for a distant future. There is much time ahead of us. I wish to better a future that will exist without you. Whenever that day comes. For you. And for our son. We will always walk together, Kratos. You will always be a part of me. I will always be a part of you. When you are gone, that part of me dies as well. Do you feel your absence? No. The culmination of love is grief. And yet we love, despite the inevitable. We open our hearts. When the pyre is spent, and you have gathered my ashes, spread them from the highest peak in all the realms. You will do this for me. to have loved fully. Open your heart to the world as you have opened it to me and you will find every reason to keep living in it. Are you guys gonna kiss?